Hello out there and welcome to English Geeky Plays. We're here with Mini Racers Tiny Split Screen Tournament. It's a new game, it's on Steam, and uh, and we're gonna play. Uh, so I can choose my car. Um, show... There's a few different cars there, that's cool. There's quite a few cars. Alright, so we've gone through all the cars. I mean, I guess we go with that, and we go... Sure. Do I want to... I'll start that championship. Sure. Let's go. I don't know what the buttons are, though. I don't... I don't know what the controls are. Okay. Um... Is it a controller game? I don't... I uh, appreciate not having any, uh... So we can... We can turn the... Turn the wheel, I guess. Oh, I don't know what just happened. Just resetting. Okay. Nope. All right. Um, okay, how do we... Well, at least we got to see some more of the map. So the only button that works is Y. Um, so nothing... It's all... Nothing works. Oh, there we go. It's arrow keys, I guess? I don't know, man. Okay, right. So, I've got the controller plugged in, and it sort of did something with the controller. Alright, well, we're in last place. Cool. So, sure. Okay, so I restarted, um, because the game actually crashed out, um, and, I've, and, and now that I know that it's arrow keys... Right. So we're just rocking, I guess. Cool. No, there's no no way to get out of this, um, because the there's no button on here that does that. So we're just we're just stuck here perpetually tortoising. I'm having a great time. I love it. Oh, we finally we finally respawn. That's good. That's really good. Love it. Seems uh, totally fair. But at least we're just in third, so um, the AI is just as bad as we are, which is good. Well, at least that one AI is just as bad as we are. Let's let's hope it doesn't crash again, because um, that wasn't fun. A little crash to desktop to uh, to ruin our fun. And here's where we, cool. So now now we're just waiting, I guess. Gotta love that jump that, uh, just a relatively normal drive off of it means that you, you crash. Right. Um, I'm, I'm telling you guys, uh, the cars handle terribly. Um, it does not feel nice to drive the cars at all. I, I get the idea is that they're supposed to be like little mini Hot Wheels racers, but they are not fun to drive at all. Uh, let's see if we can avoid... Nope, we can't avoid it. There doesn't seem to be a, way, be a way to clear that jump, so... Okay. So, we're, we're just driving along, I guess. I haven't seen another car in a long time, but we're still, we're still in um, third place, rather than fourth, or moving up. I I, right, so we finished. Great. Let's go to the next track. Let's go to the next track. Sure. Right, so... Oh my god. So why... Why am I not respawning? Right. So... I crashed. And so then... I had to wait. And then respawn. I guess. I guess that's fair. I don't know. I drive over the rulers. I don't... I don't know where the road is here. I guess I found the road. We're in first. We're winning. Yay! Oh, it's the um, it's the shining carpet. The car the carpet is from the shining. The Overlook Hotel. Classic. So maybe we're in the Overlook Hotel, and these are the games that the twins are playing. Ooh. Yeah. 
fun. Right. So, yeah, there's just nothing, there's nothing to this game. There's nothing like, yeah, it like, it technically functions, um, but you can't get a menu. Uh, once the, once the round is going, there's no menu to get. I tried. Um, and then, uh, sometimes it will just crash to desktop. So that's a thing that will happen. Um, oh. We'll see if we even respawn. Oh yeah, sometimes it takes ages to respawn. The music is way too loud. I've had to turn it down quite a bit. So are we do we do we have to wait for the other guys to finish? Oh no, cool. So we're tied for first. Great. We'll go to the, this is the final race. So this is the one that matters, and we're gonna win it. I can feel it. Right. So we just drive along, I guess. <sighs> so there's some balls that roll across, I guess. It didn't seem like much of a hazard. I guess we're going this way. I'm just guessing, of course. It's really hard to tell which way we're actually going at any given time. And we got some sand castles. Oop. Luckily, it just doesn't matter. Um, so that was the first lap. We're still in first place. We're gonna win the prize, I can feel it. Right, so these things aren't actually dangerous, I don't think. Yeah. That did nothing. Didn't crush me, didn't do anything, it barely even slowed me down. Oop. Oh, how do I get out of here? There we go, so now we're in second. Right. Because we got stuck. Um, I can see him up there. We'll see if we can catch him. I'm feeling the excitement of the, uh, of the music. You know, it all feels just, uh, very exciting and thrilling. I think the only thing that I like is the environment. The environment's pretty cool. All right. No, we didn't quite make it. So we're gonna come in second. Right. I don't. I don't want to play again. I don't. Sure. Oh, we didn't win the first one. There's seven seven tournaments. Right. Okay. Well, let's have a look at uh, local multiplayer. Sure. How do we? How do we do two pl Sure, let's do that. How do, how do how does it run that? Like what what are the controls? Um I cuz it, there's nowhere that says what the controls are and uh, the tiny split screen multiplayer is literally in the title. So I'm going to try and race with two cars. Or not? Or the game might have frozen. So I'll just fast forward, I guess, until we get to uh, some content. Uh, and if it doesn't load up, I'm just going to go to the description, so. So obviously it didn't work. It just froze there and just kept playing the same looped music over and over and over again and that's fine. So here we are looking at the description to see what the game has to say for itself. So uh, mini car racing tiny split screen tournament. Welcome to the one and only tiny split screen racing tournament. 
Grab a friend or none if no one is around, strap on your seatbelt and hit the road in more than 24 hot and lovely designed mini tracks. It's fast, it's fun, it's exciting, it's time for mini car racing. It's not fast, it's not very fun, it's not exciting at all, uh, and it breaks a lot. The, the game doesn't really work very well. Um, developed by EpiXR Games UG, sure. Cost $9.91, fine. Um, we want to make sure that the game will have a great user experience. Therefore, we want to develop game together with the community and adjust the game to the needs and wishes of our community. Great. Um, two to three months of early access, sure. Um, how is the full version plan different from the early access version? Generally, this is depending on the user feedback that we receive. The game is currently in a very stable state. Not really. It crashed twice. I tried to. I played it for ten minutes. It crashed twice. It is fun to play and features 16 tracks and on interesting computer AI. Depending on what the community wants, we could enhance the existing levels, add more levels, and game mechanics, or improve the overall gameplay. As said, the final changes depend on your feedback. Or you could just make a game. Stop expecting players to develop your game for you. Make a fun game, then people will give you feedback. What you've made is just very, very bare bones. Um, Let's see, most probably the price will stay the same, sure. Let's see, uh, we already read that. Mini car racing, uh, a single player and local player multiplayer mode with one to four players. Play together against your friends if you have any. Experience a fun and exciting road rage. Sure, I just, I, w I was never invested enough in the game to get road rage. Uh, feel the speed of the tiny cars while bursting over one of the 24 specifically designed tracks. The cars feel very slow and terrible to control. They feel terrible to control. Um, enjoy an intriguing and action-packed soundtrack. It's not. Um, show your friends who the boss is, you. No. Yeah, so the game is very dull. The most interesting thing about the game is the environments. Um, and once you've seen them, they get very dull as well. Um, there's just nothing to it. You're just driving on a track around an environment, which is fine. Um, but, you know, when there's games like Mario Kart or, like, realistic ones, or even other mini car racing games that are much more interesting than this, you just, you, you're adding nothing to the conversation here. Um, so this is uh, the developer, XB, Airy, whatever, right? So, I guess they made Life of Fly. I quite liked Life of Fly. That was pretty fun. Um, I don't like mini car racing, tiny split screen tournament. Um, not the least of which is uh, because that uh, because it crashed twice while we were playing it. Um, so that's not that's not good enough. We got Airy Sky Castle. Yeah, so we, we've looked at we've looked at these people before. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. This is this is not this is not great. Um, and it says it's very stable, but it's actually not. And like I said, it's not actually adding anything to an already packed genre of racing games. The controls are bad. They're not remappable. Um, once you're in a match, you can't actually access the menu. Uh, it's just nonsense. It's all nonsense. This is just not good. So I liked Life of Fly. I do not like this game. Um, I'm going to leave it there. I don't want to keep, you know, railing on about the things I don't like about this. The controls are bad. Um, the music is, yeah, it's fine, but it would be fine. It would be okay if the gameplay was fun, which it's not. So then the, the soundtrack starts to grate. Um, the actual game itself just feels not fun. So I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below. If you want to check out the game, I will put the link in the description. Um, and, uh, you guys stay safe out there and I'll see you next time. Class dismissed.